and welcome back to another video. I'm Evan the Juggler, and these are the juggling balls that I perform with on a daily basis. Almost a daily basis. So, let's give them a full review for you. Let's hop right into it. <laughs> so, like I said, I use these on, like, essentially a daily basis. I'll juggle with them to practice, to perform, to busk with, to just show people cool tricks, film Instagram videos, literally everything. So I think I definitely am qualified to give these a decent review. These balls have been around for such a long time, these are actually my first juggling balls. Obviously I've bought new ones since then, and the quality has not changed in the 10 years I have been juggling. And not only that, but they're actually made here in Canada, which I definitely approve of. They are hand-sewn and can be found in most toy stores now. Like before, I didn't see them very often, but now they're pretty much everywhere, which is fantastic. The only problem with that is you don't really get a lot of choice on color. So, so far what I've bought from Higgins Brothers are the HB Juggling Ball, which are the most basic ones and the most popular ones. And then recently I have bought the HB Artiste Ball, which I also have a lot of good things to say about. The only real difference between the HB Juggling Ball and the HB Artiste Ball is that the Artiste Ball is ever so slightly bigger. And with that, they're a little heavier too. So they're great for being on stage and I can juggle up to five balls of them without it being too hard. And it doesn't just stop with the HB Juggling Ball and the Artiste Ball. They also have the HB Small Ball, Candy Juggling Ball, Spanky Juggling Ball, Terrapin Juggling Ball, 8 Panel Juggling Balls, Performer Balls, and HB Big Balls. You can even buy them in bulk if you really wanted to. All the different sizes of balls are actually the same quality and material, so it doesn't really matter which one you get for quality-wise, just size preferences. So the first thing to talk about is the great selection of colors. There are so many to choose from, it goes all over the rainbow, and with a bunch of different patterns. You can get solid colors, two colors, or even up to four colors. It's just a crazy how many you can get. And they're constantly updating what colors they choose, too. So, get them while you want them. <laughs> Depending on the ball you get, they do have a limited selection of the colors. Like, the big ball only comes in red, green, yellow, and blue, and the HB Juggling Ball right now comes in about 31 different colors. So depending on the size you want, the colors are limited. But realistically, this has never stopped me from buying a juggling ball because they always have amazing, vibrant colors to choose from. And even after years of use, the colors are still nice and bright. But they definitely do fade over time. But that takes many, many years. And of course, with that, they're super customizable to whatever kind of performance or show you want to put on. Whether you just want to juggle with them and you really like the color white, or it'll be really easy to find juggling balls that match the aesthetic that you're going for. Size-wise, that is also super helpful, and pretty much all of them are perfectly juggleable and don't really limit the tricks that you are trying to do, except for maybe the gigantic ones. <laughs> the best part about these balls is that they are bean bags, which means they don't roll away. So performing with them on stage is much more relaxing than juggling with a stage ball that will definitely roll away very, very fast. And not only that, they do look really professional from far away too and up close. So whether you're doing a more personal performance, or one for a bigger audience, they're good for it. So these are definitely a great beginner and professional juggling ball. They're great to learn with, practice with, and perform with. The one con with these juggling balls, the one thing that does get kind of annoying, is the fact that they do break down fairly fast, because they are beanbags. But, realistically, these ones are about a year old, these are two years old, <laughs> these are five years old, and these are 10 years old. So really, they do last a super long time, but to keep them in top, perfect, pristine condition, it is a little challenging, and you definitely don't want to juggle them over concrete for too long. Because this is what happens. <laughs> and of course, concrete is the reason that my balls, that my sets of juggling balls wear down so fast. And for any normal person, they will last a ridiculously long time. So when should you buy these juggling balls? Essentially, you should buy them if you're a juggler, because they're super versatile. And really, it doesn't matter if you're a beginner learning, or professional just practicing, or even performing. All of the above, these are fantastic juggling balls. You probably shouldn't buy them if you're planning on juggling on concrete and are very, very particular about how your juggling balls look and in pristine condition for such a long time, because they will wear down a little bit if you're really rough with them. So you definitely want to juggle them over carpet or just a regular stage. And juggling them over concrete really only starts affecting them after many, many hours before they start to break down. 
Another cool thing about these juggling balls is that the older they are, the easier it is to do stalls with. So really, when they wear in, they just turn into a different set of juggling balls. And you can do cool tricks like this one right here. You should buy these balls if you don't want a ball that will roll away from you very far when you drop them. Because, of course, bean bags are amazing for that, unlike stage balls. These balls are also super affordable at under $10 a ball, which is always amazing to see. Because once it's over $10 a ball, not only if you lose one, that's a problem. And on top of that, another con is that sadly they're a little hard to replace if you lose one, because if you've been juggling them for over two years, they have worn down a decent amount. And you can really tell the difference between a new ball and an old one. So you'll have to buy at least a couple more together so that they're more close in both aesthetic and feel while you're juggling. So overall, I would rate these balls about a solid 9.5 out of 10 because they literally are the perfect juggling ball. They just wear down a little bit faster than I'd like, just slightly. Because really, I'm asking a lot out of them. So. I would definitely suggest getting these if you are any level of juggler, whether it's beginner just learning or professional trying seven balls at a time. They are fantastic balls and I would definitely suggest checking them out. They are affordable, they are customizable, really what else is there to ask for? <laughs> They're fantastic. So there you have it folks. That is my review of the HB juggling ball, which of course are my favorite juggling balls and the ones that I use pretty much every single day. I would definitely suggest checking them out. And of course, that is the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel. You can even click here for some other really cool juggling related content. And of course, you can follow me on Instagram or like my Facebook page. Links in the description down below. And with that, <laughs> thanks for watching.